Hello, and here it is. For uh, for the first time on this channel, Nintendo Emulator. When I was a kid, I spent hours and hours playing Super Mario, Contra, and other Nintendo games. Uh, this was my favorite game. Uh, we call this game Tenkichi, uh, which means little thanks, but the uh, real name of, of this game is Battle City. So, I finally got my uh, SD card module and now I'm able to make something like this. I still need to buy a module for sound, but uh, this is cute and fun even, even without sound. Here are components. This is of course SD card module. This is well-known ESP32 development board and this is a 240 by 240 uh, IPS TFT display. And check my, you can check my other, other videos because I used these two guys quite a bit. I uh, tried tried to make this breadboard Nintendo cheapest as possible, so all these uh, modules will cost you less than 15 American dollars. You can find affiliate links uh, in description, so you can check components later. In uh, this video I will try to help you build this breadboard Nintendo. Believe me, it's not hard. And the best part is that when uh, you upload uh, your program or your Arduino sketch, because we are using Arduino IDE for this, uh, when you upload your sketch, you can play any Nitin Nintendo games. Games are stored in this SD card. So you will need some sort of adapter to connect SD card to PC. Uh, one connected to PC SD card acts like like normal USB flash drive. Uh, in, on SD card you will need to have this NES folder and inside this folder you will need to put NES files you will need to put your games. You can download your files, uh, games for free all over, all over the internet. There is a lot, uh, there is a lot of uh, Nintendo games. Uh, in the description of this video I will put a link uh, for basic set of games. Uh, don't forget to make an ES folder on your SD card. Uh, now I will show you how to, where you will find code. But first I would like to invite you to subscribe to this channel. Thank you. Okay, I find it code on this GitHub site. So, thank you Mr. Nethalis. I am child forever. Me too, Mr. Nathalys, me too. Thank you for your work. So, we will use this code. We will use Arduino IDE. First, you need to download code. You will download whole zip file. I will download it in a music folder. Music folder is my like desktop main folder. Okay, we will extract all from zip archive and here we have these. So, first you will need to install all libraries. Libraries are here. You will extract all these zip files and you will, for example, you, you will need to put uh, 
all the content in your library folder. For example, I will extract this as the fat library. Okay, and I will copy this folder to my Arduino libraries and here it is. And now we can open Arduino Sketch. So this is Sketch. We have this nice cat image. And you can see that our connections are very easy. Here you can see how to connect push up uh, push up buttons. Here you can see how to connect your TFT display. Uh, in my case, I'm not using audio module, and these are pins for micro SD card. Uh, first, I tried these default pins and project worked perfectly uh, but then I try to make this on a breadboard so I have troubles with too many wires so I change this configuration pins uh, a bit so um, so uh, connect to connecting modules to breadboard was much easier I will also I will also put my pin setup in description if you want to uh, connect your modulus on similar way. Also these little wi wires can also help a lot. And after uploading your code to ESP32 board you will need to download games and put them on your SD card and you are ready to go and to have fun playing your Nintendo games from your childhood. Uh, thank you. I, I hope this video was helpful. I hope you learned something and I hope uh, you had fun. Uh, if you want you can uh, support this channel by buying me coffee like always the link is in the description uh, feel free to share this video to like to comment tell me what you think and have a nice day goodbye enjoy more games